How you guys doing? This is James. This is Have the Conversation. I like to talk about uh, controversial and pop culture topics so we can teach the children how to be better for the future because this world is their inheritance. Right now, I want to talk about body positivity and self-absorption. And the reason why I say self-absorption is because the way a lot of you guys post on Instagram, post on, yeah, it's mainly Instagram right now. The way you post on there, it's, in today's day and age, okay, we should be, in my opinion, we should not be posting your bodies on Instagram and Twitter and things like that. Selena Gomez said it best in her 2016 acceptance speech at the AMAs. I'm tired of seeing your bodies on Instagram. I want to see what's in here. That's exactly what she said. And I can agree with that. And it speaks to this whole video today. Would we really, would it really be better for society is that we actually share our struggles and share our insights and share our ideas and visions with each other. Sharing your body with the whole world is not per se conducive to society. What is it really doing for anybody? It's only doing something for yourself and that's why I want to go in the that's why I'm saying body absorption or self-absorption. Body positivity is nothing wrong with being positive about yourself. There's nothing ever wrong with being positive about your body image. The thing that does go wrong and does go left is where we get self-absorbed into ourselves based upon our body. That's what we go wrong with it. We, like she was saying on, on the, in her acceptance speech, and I very much agree with her. Let's see what's inside here and let's see what's inside here because all your body is is a shell. What is inside of it, and we've heard this a thousand times, what is inside of your body, what's inside your mind, what's inside your heart is the real person. The outside is just a shape. That's all it is, it's a shape. There was a time 20 years ago when your body was sacred. And the way we're posting on Instagram these days with ladies and men for that matter. Women posting bikini pictures and things like this with 90% of your skin showing. And fellas doing the same thing. Posting muscle pictures and things like that. These images are supposed to be for your significant other. It's not supposed to be for everyone else to see. And that's why I say there's not, it's not sacred. We are supposed to be giving our bodies to our partners. We're not supposed to be giving our bodies to the world. We're not supposed to do that. Our bodies are for us and our bodies are for our mates. Our bodies are not for the entire world to see in that manner. If you're going to post pictures, post them in flattering clothes, not bikinis, not your underwear. Fellas, likewise. If you're going to post body pictures, post them in a nice suit, post them in, in nice clothing. What we really need to see these days is positive affirmations, positive quotes. Your, your, what happened with you in your day, how you want to get better in life and things like that. Seeing your body on Instagram and seeing all these shots of you and all these things with your showing 90% of your body. All we think we, we missing is the genitals. Pretty much. Every time you see these body positive every time you see my video gets glitched, that's why I pause. Every time we see these pictures on Instagram, we're seeing 90% of your body. And the only thing that you're covering up is your genital areas. That's a problem. The only one who deserves to see that is whoever you're uh, dating. Whoever you're sleeping with. No one else needs to see that. No one else deserves to see that. Except for, the, except for who your person is. Children. Parents. Teach your children that the body is a sacred thing. The mind and heart are the things that we really should be sharing with each other. Not pictures of our body. Because those pictures of your body lead to you meeting the wrong people for the wrong things. And this gets me to another little area where 
a lot of people on Instagram these days, what I've seen, you know, TikTok too, they sit up there and they just literally sit there like this and watch the comments go up and down. And those comments are the same thing on Instagram. I love you, you're so cute, this, that, and third. People just sitting there just with a thirst for entertainment. Instead of thirsting for likes and hearts and comments and affirmations from other people, why don't you feed that into the world? Because someone needs to hear these things. Someone needs to hear these positive affirmations. We need to stop posting our bikini bodies on Instagram. Post yourself in flattering clothes and talk about your vision for life or talk about how you got over something. How to talk about how you got over a heartache. Talk about your next moves in life. Talk about how beautiful the world is. Talk, just give us your beauty and your mind and your heart. We don't need to see the. We don't need to see your naked body because that is for your person. Love you guys. Subscribe, like, share. Let this thing go viral. Love you guys.